There are many things we take for granted every day, including our ability to see and hear. One group visiting South Mississippi is showing us you don't have to let the differences hold you back from experiences. Will Polston has the story. Right there. You may have heard that noise. You may see the dolphin, but most of these adults cannot. But that isn't stopping them from having fun. I'm deaf blind and I, I can't see it, so we depend on feeling. These are members of the Affiliated Blind of Louisiana. They came to the Gulf Coast to visit the Institute for Marine Mammal Studies, interacting with dolphins and stingrays. It was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed it. And then it'd be a good memory, too, to look, look back to. This is part of the organization's initiative, Choices and Opportunities for the Elderly Blind, or Project COPE. This project helps build confidence and provide some fun along the way. IMMS President Dr. Moby Salangi says that this visit would provide a new opportunity for them and his staff. I've been hearing impaired and sight impaired. It's a tough situation. And uh, these type of memorable uh, experiences really lightens up their lives. For Jackie Broussard, this experience reminded her of memories she had as a child. Uh, I've watched TV shows, uh, the TV show Flippers. <laughs> uh, at that time, I was able to see. Lost my vision and so I really didn't know what they looked like anymore and I never felt them. So today, I was able to touch them and now I'll, I'll have this memory. Being able to interact with the animals made them feel like they could do anything. You know, it doesn't matter if you're scared, you know, you should just uh, fight that fear and go through it and, and experience it. In Gulfport, I'm Will Polston, WLOX News Now.